probably just hasn't played enough of it to hate it yet. Yeah. He only, literally, the only thing, I'm pretty sure the only thing Santi likes about Smash 4 is that every stage is that game. That's true. Santi's favorite stage by far is FD. Yep, definitely. Alright, oh wait, are they going down already? Oh no, hand warm. Oh, I got here oh. like hella late because I have lab, so I didn't enter. Yeah. Alright, they're going at it, so I got it. I wasn't done. So my prediction is uh, Swift looking still pretty into it. Yeah. I don't know. He was making like, he was playing pretty good, but making like dumb decisions versus Santi near the ledge, which cost him. And versus Sheik, those those kind of mistakes can be equally as costly, although not as fast as Fox and Shine Spike. Mm -hmm. So I'm predicting close matches, much closer than Santi's at yeah, least. Yeah, I'm but, definitely uh, predicting close. It was really close, but Squid did uh, pull it out over Kira. Yeah, I'm I'm feeling Dave on this set. Dave's usually pretty good at adapting when he loses. Most of the time, when I take a winner set versus Dave, he takes set one of grand finals. All right, all right. Um, Squid just took first stock. Uh, mm -hmm. Ooh, oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. That would have been cool. Dude, the DI off the platform or whatever is the greatest thing in Melee. It's such a great defensive tactic, although it's really hard to do, especially consistently. Mm -hmm. Well, then there's people like Johnny or S2J who get it like all the time. So I guess there is some kind of way to get consistency. There's a way to get consistent at everything, but it's just really hard to get consistent at like, certain No, things. that was a really, really questionable nair. He wasn't... Oh. He didn't quite go the full full distance for that because he came up just short on Dave's shield and got shield grab right next to the ledge. And he is still alive. He didn't get gimp. Mm -hmm. But I'm saying he could have died for that. And if that keeps happening during the set, if he didn't reevaluate that, he could die really I, early. I just realized we're on Fountain again <laughs> from last time. Yeah, I guess they like... I guess Squid likes uh, striking the Fountain. I don't know. Pretty good. Pretty good shield pressure, bread. Good. Back air. Okay. Oh, okay. Nice. Forward smash. All right. When the platform is low enough, uh, you can just yeah. Forward for smash is tall enough that you can just nail him with that. Nice. He opens up Dave. Opening up Sheik when you're at high percent is pretty good because then you can control her for the next like 20 seconds or whatever. Ooh. Especially off of her invincibility. Sheik's kind of hard to deal with when she comes back with invincibility and she's got center stage. I like how back and forth this is right now. Um, Club, right? I think Squid is winning the neutral, but Kira's keeping up pretty well. And Kira, um, you think Kira adapts faster than Squid? I just told you, dude. The human body can adapt faster than these things. But uh, Dave's really good at. Um, I don't know what he is, but it, he's just he's persistent. With melee, it's all it's all heart. So if you get if you like lose heart, like after you drop a match or whatever. You can just get whooped in the next few matches. But Dave, he just never, he never loses faith. He's always like, I can, I can still do this. Which is, I think, his, one of his strengths. Again, Squid opens up Dave in the exact yeah. same way. Squid. Dave's going to have uh, to get around that. Just shooting, just shooting that gun at him right now. Ooh. This is a great situation for Squid because he's not quite at the percent. Okay, well, now he is, but I was oh, going to say dip. he wasn't quite at the percent where one hit's nice. going to put him into like a tech scenario where he'd get pwned. But Dave got a really good sequence of hits right there and managed to take Jeremy's stock anyway. Mm -hmm. And now, of course, Jeremy's a little worried because he doesn't want to get gimped or anything. Yeah. And that kind of stuff can't happen to Sheik, especially with Falco. Oh, that was a nuts back air. Oh. He DC'd him with like a reverse back air. Okay. Nice down smash. Good down smash. I don't, I don't think Dave really offs the text oh. very much. Okay, good back air. Good back air. All right, Squid takes game one. And, uh, hey, Griffin. Uh, all right, I'm going to step off the mic since uh, I'm not very good at commentating. So I'm going right, to I'm gonna hand it over to Face Roll. We got the man who blew it all just <laughs> moments ago. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, what's up, guys? What game is this? This is Melee. Oh, okay. I'm just playing. This is game two. 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 All right. Game two. 
Okay, what did Kira do wrong last game, you think? Well, basically, every time he came down from his stock, Squid just opened him up and got, like, a meaty combo on him. Okay. And uh, he was playing decent in the neutral. He didn't get any, like, gimps or anything. He had, like, a couple of good combos. Other than that, they're, like, pr playing pretty even, like, pretty back and forth. But Dave's letting himself get open too much. He could do a little bit better job on the defensive end. Okay. That was a nuts off smash out of shield, dude. And it was like, it perfectly sent him like onto the platform, just like how Squid wants. I'm gonna, maybe I'm gonna start doing that. That would seem like a pretty good dude, option. Falco's up smash is amazing. Santi's taking the chat All into right. his own hands, quite literally. Kira took that stock. I was looking away, how'd you take it? Oh, I don't slapped know. Slapped him? I was looking away also. Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> um. <gasps> oh. See, what I would have done is okay. I would have done late down air into shine grab. In case he spot dodged, it would have covered both. Oh my god. That's rough. I mean, sometimes when you go for the most technical option in every situation, that's going to happen. Yeah. And that's something you just got to live with. And I think Squid's slowly but surely learning how to live with it. Yeah, for sure. He's going to... So, I didn't actually know this, but going to Zelda... Oh, n just Squid shakes his head. Oh, man. Squid, you can still take this game. I hope you don't... Just yeah. lose faith. I think he's, I think he's fine. Yeah. He's anyway, just like shining. Mm -hmm. I didn't actually know converting to Zelda makes you just float farther. Yeah. She's so I was always confused as to why people transform to Zelda and then transform back into Sheik. Yeah. I thought they were like sizing you up. They're like, oh, do you think, do you think I can pull off this fucking sick ass Zelda up B? And then they're like, nah, I'm just gonna go back to Sheik. Yeah. <laughs> no, I gotcha. She, yeah, she's really floaty, so she just like floats towards the stage. But um, the reason they turn back to Sheik is that Sheik's double jump is actually oh yeah it goes, it's better I heard Zelda's. Zelda's double jump is like it goes less distance than her fucking air dodge yeah it's pretty bad so you f no <laughs> okay he's fine <laughs> that could have been really extremely astronomically yeah, that's fine. bad situation yeah there have been a lot of times where Squid's air dodge on a stage and Kira's opted for a down smash which like didn't really convert. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Nasty combo. Nasty combo. All See, right. this is a. I was saying this earlier, but this is why I don't like Battlefield versus Dave, dude. Yeah, he got caught on the stage. Yeah. Right? I, yeah. <laughs> We're gonna have Fumi commentating instead of me. I'm peacing out. Santiago. Garbaggio. So a quick, tr a quick, All quick. Right, so guys, I'm back. They quick went to FD, dude. So quick. Quick this one. is what happened, uh, exactly what happened last time. Squid, Squid won game one, Kira won game two, and then uh, Squid takes him to FD, FD now. And he clearly didn't learn his lesson. Oh, he oh, lost his double God. jump. Dude, Squid did the funniest hand motion after he got, like, dash dance grab for the first time this match. He, like, took his hand and then, like, waved it over his head, but not, not on his hair. Just kind of like, whoosh, whoosh. Dude, and then, uh, so Santi, in your set versus Squid, like, yeah. Squid was playing so dumb near the ledge, dude. <laughs> I just want to emphasize how dumb he was versus <laughs> on, ver near the ledge. Like, he got shine spiked like eight times in a, in a three match set. Yeah. Uh, okay, when he, I know he's gonna do his, uh, you know, up B stalls. I don't know why it still doesn't hit them. Dude. Like, <laughs> I can read it and then it still doesn't work. Dude, there was one time where you actually, like, you got the shine on him, but he was yeah. invincible. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Squid doing a great job of dying away on that oh. forward tilt. So, basically, when people are up being back to the stage, sometimes Sheik will edge guard with forward tilt, but you'll be hit. But the space will be holding towards the stage because they like want to make it back, right? Yeah. But then uh, you gotta you gotta react to the forward tilt and then hold away right when that happens, and then you can avoid getting like you can avoid having the fucking forward tilt fair hit you right next to the stage and be or right next to the ledge and being dead. Ooh, nice down tilt. <gasps> oh, okay. Still nuts. He still got the up tilt off that. Okay. Okay. I don't know what he's doing. Yeah. I think if he. Dude, he's so confident in his fucking perfect ledge stalls that he should just use that to edge guard Sheik and make her go onto the stage. Yeah, that's it. That's a good point. Oh god, not looking good. I feel like Squid needs to regroup. Yeah. Okay, nice. Nice read into the stage, but he didn't punish it with the correct option. 
which means he's probably a little nervous. Or he's a little shaken up by the fact he's down three stocks to one and he just got two stocks last match. But you know, it's always possible to bring it back. Falco's just one of those characters where you can just go ham. Yeah. Okay. Like this could be up. big. Um, if he up tilt, actually, even if he up tilted, I think Dave still would have jumped out. Yeah. He's got a protect. Dave's power shielding right when he needs to be, dude. I feel like it's easier with Sheik, though. At least I've noticed. For me. I heard you can um do the like crouching power shield trick and it makes it easier. But oh, I doubt yeah. you do that. I don't yeah, know. I don't do that. But oh, she has like a big one. shield. That's why. Her shield is gigantic. Okay, that makes sense. When I go with Fox, I can't do it that Yeah, well. Fox's shield isn't quite as good as Sheik. Solid, solid two-stock again on final. Um... <laughs> yeah, like I was saying, I don't think that stage is that bad for Sheik, to be honest. I think a better yeah. pick would have been uh, Pokemon Stadium. Yeah, Pokemon Stadium would be good. It looks like he's following your advice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what is he doing? Is Kira switching? Dave, if you switch, I just want you to know you're the biggest buster on the planet, dude. I think he has to go shoot, yeah. yeah. I mean, your secondary is all just lost to Kirby. <laughs> <laughs> your secondary is definitely just almost like made it so you didn't, you weren't even a part of this set. So, I would definitely hold off on letting that, letting that happen again. Nice. Ooh. Up till dude. Up tilt's actually like when you're above it, it's so hard to get around. <laughs> it's so fast and it's fast. It comes out like it just immediately comes out after itself. Yeah. There nice. You go. Okay. Hoping com to see. Commanding a first stock. That's what Jeremy needed. That's what he wanted. That's what his heart needed. He definitely oh, doesn't want to die right here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. But you know. Okay. Squid recollecting himself, breathing. You know. All that good stuff. Him and Coley's end. Reverting to a childlike state. All that good ender game. So, nice. That was the first time someone's ever used down smash at like low percent. And I've actually thought it was like kind of a cool, good move. Dave power shield wave dashes in while Dave or while Jeremy's stuck near the near the ledge after his nair. He gets put it, puts himself in a great position. Jeremy with an exasperated Ooh. sigh after he gets grabbed yeah. near the ledge. Even though that wasn't an extremely bad situation, which leads me to believe Jeremy's like not feeling it. Yeah, this is gonna be big. Mm -hmm. He needs to mentally recollect himself. By the way, we haven't updated the score. It's two one Kira right now. Yeah, okay. okay, okay, he didn't yeah. die off that, which is good. He's he's still got time. Going down three stocks to one right now would be absolutely... I don't think it's winnable for Squid with his current yeah. mental process going on. Okay, good. Good back here. He can probably get this edge guard. Stand up. Yeah, okay, never mind. Oh, God. That was actually... Yeah, that was actually kind of a hard uh, edge guard to get, but... Dude, this guy playing Smash 4 is going nuts. <laughs> Definitely making a fool of himself, <laughs> dude. Definitely looks like an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> dude, he like gets <laughs> over his chair, like jumps twice, does like a roll, like lays on his back for like 20 seconds. <laughs> Alright, I'm out. I wanna, I'm gonna say this is over. Yeah, it's kinda over. Yeah. Oh! I feel like yeah. Kira's not a guy who really blows lead much. Yeah. Okay, honestly, even if Dave, like, killed himself right right now, and if it was a fresh 0-64, to 64, like, it still didn't seem like it would be that doable. Yeah. Like, as soon as you see a player shake their head... Yeah, it's usually bad. Yeah, it's usually, like, not a good sign. Okay, nice showing him, though. Oh! Okay, come okay. on, Squid. Okay, okay. Hoping he can okay, do despite it. what I was Don't saying, 99-0 is doable because now you're in your opponent's head. He's like, well, I just need one hit, right? And yeah. that's when they're the most vulnerable when they're trying to hit you with that obvious combo uh, stars. Oh, he read the full jump, though. Nice. <laughs> All right, 3-1 by Kira. Good, good shot, Dave. 
Good shit. Kira, lucky to be here. <laughs> yeah. Dave definitely should have lost two sets ago. <laughs>